What's up, y'all? We back in here with another Fox reaction, man. It's Mons of the Future. And today, we are starting Oceanborn. Oceanborn, the Nightwish Evolution, Oceanborn Episode 1. If you are new to the channel and you're just now seeing this one, this go check out our other ones. Of the Nightwish Evolution because we did the whole first well, album. Well, we done Angels Fall first, the whole album. We didn't do the demo songs, but we'll probably go back and do this. We did all. the original studio album, uh, Stargazers, the first song of Oceanborn. I'm excited because everybody said this album blows the last one away, which the al last album wasn't that bad. It was no. just the production quality wasn't the best. Which you're thinking about in the '90s when you had to be hungry. And you had to really grind to get into the business, especially as a rock or metal band. Um, you don't have much money for your first record, so you have to do with what you got. Bro, don't so, you have, didn't you get the confetti? I did, but it's in the truck. So guess what? That's tomorrow. That's tomorrow. <laughs> All right, man. So we're going to go ahead and hop into the Stargazers. First track on Oceanborn. This album cover is like a big step up too. Yeah, it is. Look at all that. That's cool. It's like a girl or something floating in the water. Add that to my tats. Man. All right. Anyways, we're gonna get right into this reaction because Ms. Man over here talking out of his mind. We're gonna get into this though. You ready? I'm ready. Oceanborn episode one. Three, two, one, go. What is that? That's not a guitar. Is it? That one, that's a, I don't know what that was. Let me go try. Oh, Vocals are better on this one. Oh, so much better quality. No bass is going at it. Oh, good joke. It's a synthesizer. I love that. Oh, God.
That's a flute, right? That's a flute. I love that. Or like a piccolo, I want to say it. I love it. Yeah, the, the production Big quality is uh, insanely different. Big step And up. that's what happens when you do well as a band on your first album. If you make enough money, or the record label likes you enough after you make your first album. Wait, which one? I wonder which album, or what year was this album put out? Uh, either 98 or 99. Dang, really? You think they put another album out year, back to back years? Oh, when you first start out, most bands do. Where'd I go for you? Uh, go to discography. Right there. 1998. Oh, dang. Okay. Huh. Most bands, their first album will come out, and then, uh, like, look, Led Zeppelin put two albums out in one year. Bro, look at this crap, bro. They went one year, two year, two year, two year, three years, mm -hmm. four years, four years, five years. <laughs> so they're just taking more and more time yeah, to get but, there. Yeah, well, yeah. Out. I mean, once you get to a certain point where you're big enough that you can take the extra time to put into your music, because once you're that young of a band, you're still trying to get your following so you can don't have to work a normal job anymore. And once you've got that following, you can take more time to create your art. Yeah, that right there was banger. For the first song in the album, that was a good start. And you also got to think, too, at this point in time in the career, like now, I mean, they're touring a lot. You know what I mean? They don't, like, they're touring a lot now because they got an album out, but they yeah. were touring a lot before that. So, one of these songs on this album is called Sleeping Sun. I don't know if we've actually heard that one. Did we do Sleeping Sun with uh, Floor? We haven't done many of Tario. We've only done Finn with the Opera with Tario, but, well, before we started the not with Ghost Jewish. Love Score. We didn't do her with. We didn't do. No, that was. We done the original, and then everybody told us to go check out the live version. But it was still floor. Not the. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it was still floor. I don't think so. I think the original Ghost Love score we listened to was either Annette or Tarja. I'm pretty sure it's Annette. Anyways, I, I don't know. But we're gonna get to these comments from the Dimash Kuda Bergen Diva Dance video. Yeah. And Confessor. Aye. Go. Before we get into what? Oh, before we get into these shout outs, <laughs> you got any comments, recommendations, requests, go to the comment section down below. Make sure you give us a like so we'll be a bit quicker. Oh. Follow the link above Fathead personal accounts in the description. Anything you want to say, ask us, go right ahead. Merch link and bio gets to 7K. You've already got us to 6.3 almost, and we just hit 6K like two days ago, maybe now. So, it's crazy. Take it away, burnt ramen noodle head. Okay, buddy. You know what your hair looks like when you burn the beef and chili mixed flavoring of ramen noodles. That's what your hair looks like. Yeah, like when you don't put no water in it and it turns black. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Okay, this person's just gonna make me mad because they they act like if you want to make a reaction video, at least learn adequate, adequate first. It's rude to change people's names as a joke. And they're talking about Dimash. I don't, I didn't change Dimash's name as a joke. I, I say Dimash Kud Kudabergen because that's the way it looks. But apparently it's Kuday Bergen or something like that. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hop <laughs> off before you but, piss me in. I'm going to piss in your Cheerios. <laughs> Leave. I just say... I'm not doing it. <laughs> I just say Kuday Bergen because that's... I mean, I don't know how to pronounce it correctly. It don't matter. The, they sh We're American. We can't speak that language good. So, if you don't like it, hop off because there's some names on here that we have... We just make fun of because... Mainly because we don't know how to pronounce them. So, but I don't wait to find to watch that. I just don't know how to pronounce Mr. them. Mr. School Teacher, go on, <laughs> hop on some other 12-year-old. 
Wait a minute. I'm not 12. Sorry. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> Nikki Hagverdy. Not a good day. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Please react to Bastu version of Diva Dance. Yeah, they said he does the one with uh, this other, like, rapper or something. Like a Chinese rapper. Oh, really? Japanese rapper. And they said it's a better version, so we might have to get into that. That'd be cool. Because we didn't get to see a Japanese rapper yet. Oh, well, those are three thumbs up. I thought that was three birds. <laughs> I'm already set now because of this jerk over here. Uh, D. Danford, I knew you guys would like this one. Here's another one for you since you go, since you look to be that age that you grew up watching Power Rangers. <laughs> Dimash record the Go Go Power Rangers theme song for the Chinese release of the mu of the movie. Thanks for your reaction to a wide variety of music. Cheers from California. Really? Uh, That's cool. That is actually cool. Like I I watched the Power Rangers a little bit when I was little. Like when I was little little. I wasn't a big Power Rangers guy. I never really was. Like when I was a kid growing up, my like my favorite shows when I was watching when I was little was like SpongeBob and Drake and Josh. That's what I watched a lot. So I right, Sandra Christensen, you guys crack me up. Go look up what the gulag is now. So, I don't actually know what the gulag is. The before. gulag. It's the gulag. It's the gulag. It's the gulag, bro. No, it's bro, called... Bro, Sacer made fun of you the other night because you called it the gulag because he heard it on one of the videos. The dude on the video game calls it the it's, gulag. It's the gulag. It's, not, it's the gulag, not the gulag. The, all, the, the dude that talks to you the whole time you're doing Warzone. He just got an accent. It's, a, it's the gulag. He, he calls it the gulag. It's the gulag. It's the gulag. It's the gulag. It's the gulag. <laughs> And I don't that. know what it was before Warzone. I don't want to know, to be honest with you, because ain't no telling what it was. Yeah. Anyways. I think the man on the game knows what he's talking about. I don't think he did. Flavian Tisa Deem. Here he was ill. The best version of Dimash's Diva Dance is in the Bastu concert where he was healthy. Here's a proof that the worst of the boss is better than the best of others. So if that man was ill doing that, <laughs> that part right there, bro, I don't know. I, don't, I can't do it, obviously. But uh, if he was ill when he was doing that, man's a masterpiece. Anyways, that's all we need to do for this video, man. We got to get on out of here and get to the next reaction because we on a rush schedule today. Big fella needs some sleep because he's a little grumpy. Yeah. And he needs some food, too, in his system because Big Boy always got to eat. I told you all the video. Make sure to like, share, Where do you live? I want to see you. I want to see you. Like, please. I cannot stand when you. Man, just close out the video. Oh, Be no. quiet, bro. No, I'm bringing this up because I've seen another one last night that made me mad. I'm leaving. When you get on here and you get on this comment section, do you not watch the videos where I talk about if you act like a jerk, you're going to piss me off and I will say something? Here's a few reasons. You get on here and you want to talk about. We don't. We make fun of people's names. <laughs> oh, I bet somebody made fun of your name. I probably should right now. What's your name? <laughs> you can't say it. I don't know. I'd say it. It's it's uh. It's that person out right there, but it was a different comment. Mm. I don't uh, care about your name. <laughs> but there's you. And then there's people that argue me down on what instrument the man's making with his freaking voice. I'm sorry, but it was a violin. No, it wasn't. No, it was not a violin. And then you got others that just hop on here to be jerks on purpose. So, congratulations. Close the video out. No. <laughs> You've already woken me up for this I'm now. about to wake you up some more with this big old fist over here, boy. So, click the bell and don't comment if you're going to be a jerk. That was the fakest angry voice I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> and y'all know what we do with the Diddly Do crew. <laughs> he's not actually mad, he's just stupid. You don't have to game. We'll see next video, man. Peace. Peace. <laughs> oh my god. You need to open peace song, bro. You said peace.